You end a lot of days on the runway at Drake Field, don't you? No. Well, is that a casino? You can't go wrong around a casino. I got this to be a good one. Tonight we are flying to the West Memphis, right? To do a uh, Razorback Club. I have no idea um, what number, but it's a lot of them. And uh, this one's always a good crowd because it's at the dog track. So you got a little dog track casino. Uh, you got a bar, so they'll have a few uh, few pops before we get there. They'll usually be a little bit rowdy. Yeah. And you couple that with this year's victory over the uh, K-State Wildcats. Good showing by the uh, Razorbacks in town. Should be a pretty, pretty intense crowd. As we go around and do these different clubs, it's uh, it's always awesome. Everywhere you go, you know, you know you're gonna run into Razorback fans, and you're gonna, uh, you know, go into a certain environment. I knew we were coming here. Uh, my first year, I got a chance to come here, and I uh, didn't know we were going to a dog track, and I didn't know we were going to a casino. Hell, I wanted to stay for a little bit. Uh, thank you. Come here, man. What's up, fellas? You think you signed that? To Tinker. Tinker, T-I? Just like Tinkerbell. K-E-R, who's Tinker? I like your hair. Can I borrow that bow sometime? Every every club uh, is different. My mom keeps on trying to trick me into liking Alabama. Like, your mom keeps trying to trick you into liking Alabama. You gotta tell somebody the authorities. I like the bling on the shirt. That's a little play. That's a little play. Sorry. That's right, and I'm looking to blame. Where'd you get that? Cracker Barrel. Get there. Cracker Barrel. Yes. Sell so shirts? Run around there. Can you believe that? No, I don't. <laughs> All right, there's one that we did. Manila, that airport, the deer run out on the runway. So they have ATVs running along the edge of the runway so that the deer, they skeet the deer away from running out in front of the plane. Real scientific. The animal goes down in a fatal deer, deer plane crash. Well, take a that, yep. Is that okay? My wife loves these photos. Yeah, that's right. All right. Just had to take this picture. Two, three. Okay. Never like beeps. Double beeps, really. Yeah, never like beeps. Hey, Sue, raise your back. Well, this plane's from 1986. I'm like, 1986 is cool in like collector's items and cards, not in planes that you fly in. <laughs> But these guys, all, all the pilots are always like, uh, the military uses airplanes for 50 years. I'm like, well, that's great. They also probably have a parachute on their ass. <laughs> so I said to these guys, they go, do we get a parachute on this one? No. <laughs> have you ever thought about jumping out of an airplane parachute? Well, if it's that or the plane going down, I'll be jumping. Yeah, sure. I'm not gonna jump out of one that's flying perfectly. <laughs> and we have a freshman. Uh, that's gonna be coming in, a little guy, he's 6'7", 267. And he can throw the ball, man, he can, he can really wing the ball. He can't speak all that well. Um, he's got that Cajun, you know, dialect going. Uh, might be the first time in, in my coaching history where the guards might make the calls. Um, just because I can't understand him. If he talks to me and I don't know what he's talking about, I have to take it twice. Uh, this year we have a crossover game with Florida, which should be, I think, a lot of fun. We're the only team in the conference that will play both the SEC East and West champions from a year ago. Um, I love that computer. Wherever that computer is, it decides who the hell we're playing. I, I would love to take a bat to that thing. Uh, just, just see how real it is. Patrick doesn't like this. Talk about how wide we are in this runway. We're recruiting Dion Stewart out of Highland. Yeah, Highland. Right now, we are like 100 yards away from being on the runway. Like at this, and, and we're, we're keep going down. And Michael Smith's looking at me. Barry Lunny's looking at me, and I'm sitting here like this. We're in this plane, and I'm like, boys, we ain't gonna, we ain't, I'm like, we ain't gonna make it. All of a sudden, straight up in the air, we took off, because they couldn't get it down, you know? And, I mean, Barry Lunny looked like he had turned into a ghost. Michael Smith, who was African-American, looked very, very white at the moment. <laughs> Pilots came on, and they're like, uh, we're gonna take it around for another try. I'm like, yeah, no kidding, right? So we came in, we landed on the next one. And I mean, it was like, it was spooky. I mean, like, you're like thinking, what are we doing? Yeah. I'm like, I like Deion Stewart as a player, but I'm not gonna go down for him. <laughs> the statement was, we like beating Ole Miss, and the question is, could we put the hunt under Henry? Well, you didn't think it was in the playbook? You thought that was, <laughs> you don't think that was coached? Thank you very much, God bless, Woo Pig.
Hey, what's going on? Just Alabama. I'm with you. Them in Mississippi State. Unleash your inner fan with a Centennial Bank debit card. Get a custom card with your favorite team's logo, printed in minutes at any Centennial Bank location. Come on, show your team spirit with a Centennial Bank debit card. And someone from my staff could walk in and give me the greatest idea since beer in a can, you know what I mean? So like, that might, it could be something really good, and then you realize, wait a minute, I'm in a bad mood. I don't even hear what he's saying.